Georgia 2, Portugal nil. This is the biggest result for Georgia. Georgia. These boys came out to play. Kvaratskela. Oh my goodness. I just need to give you a big, big shout out. Kochorashvili. In midfield. These guys, this is this is definitely the biggest result of, of their footballing career ever. Because again, last game, they actually got their first ever points. I think they drew with, um, I want to say Takie. I want to say Takie. Or Czechia. I think they drew with Czechia in their last game. No, it was Czechia. Takie beat them. They drew with um, Takie 1-1 to get their first ever point at the Euros. This is now their first ever win at the Euros against Ronaldo and Bruno and Fab Francisco Concesao and uh, Diogo Jota and Bernardo Silva. I know those guys didn't play. I know Bernardo Silva and Bruno didn't play, but Ronaldo started. And yeah, he, he was just whining this entire game. To be fair to him, he was being held a few times, but after the first one, when he he was just it was a he was held a bit and he dove, the ref was not having it, you know. Um so yeah, Georgia man, the Kvarachkela goal after two minutes, like they did so well. The guy was just coming at um um coming at the defense over and over again. Pause. And these guys just could not do anything. They couldn't stop him at all. <laughs> they couldn't stop him. And yeah. Again, just a good finish on his left foot. Mikau Tadze, who is now the top scorer of the is the one who assisted the goal to um, Kvaratskela in the second minute. And I was watching the Belgium game earlier, and there were in so many situations similar to that, and they just couldn't lay that ball off. And that's the one thing that they did, that uh, the Georgians were doing well. Just lay the ball off and let the striker do his thing or the winger. Anyway, it was 1-0. Um, I, I don't know if this guy's... Portugal didn't really create much. Like, there was just a bit of... They were a bit disorganized in midfield. They were just there. And even at halftime, they had to take out um, Joao Palinha for Ruben Neves, who came on to partner Joao Neves in midfield. And, yeah, Portugal just looked bland, to be honest. Like, apart from, like, a few shots from far, like Dalo, um, Joao Felix looked really lively. I, I enjoyed watching him just... Um, especially in offensive transitions, how he was attacking the Georgian midfield and defense. But the Georgians were so compact. Like, there were no spaces in the middle of the park. And they know very well that Portugal are not going to use their wingers from a wide, like, going wide and, and stretching their field. So they really just use that to their advantage. Then in the second half, my only issue that I have with this game is VAR. VAR. That was not a penalty, guys. Like, I was happy. Georgia were given a penalty because I wanted them to win. Underdogs forever. But, but, the contact was minimal. Like, guys, let's just be honest. And this is the first time. Today's other game, Slovakia versus Romania, was the same way. The contact was so minuscule. That, that one was even worse. Agree, that was egregious. Egregious. This one was just, it was, yes, there was contact. But it's one where it's just like, he just grazed the top of the boot. Like, it's not even that. And then he kind of pulled back after the tackle. So, Ah, it was just such a weird, weird, weird penalty to give. But anyway, um, Mikau Tadze got the penalty. Cool, very cool, calm and collected. Can't speak today. Very cool, calm and collected. And slotted in the corner to give Georgia a 2 0 lead over Portugal. The rest of the game, they just defended so well. They were just so compact and they were just amazing, to be honest. Like, they are going to really stress Spain. They're meeting Spain in the round of 16 and they're going to stress them. Um, and yeah, they brought in Jota, they brought in Goncalo Ramos, who's come back from injury, Leto Semedo, Matheus Nunes, but Portugal still could not do anything. And just like that, Georgia have pulled off the biggest, biggest, biggest win of their small careers. And I'm looking for... Georgia, Georgia. And with that result, they also qualify for the round of 16. And I'm going to face off against Spain. I can't speak today, but who cares? They're going to play Spain. And that is just a big result. I'm just so excited. Like, I just couldn't believe it. Like, Georgia, you guys have done it. You guys are the ones. Georgia. You guys are the ones. Round Georgia. of 16. Here we come. Georgia. Georgia. In the round of 16. Facing Spain. Georgia.